Hello everybody, this is Anomaly Stratic, and welcome back to Hand of Fate. When we last left off a while back, um, I was getting my butt thoroughly tramped in the silent movie style. And uh, so let's see how we do today. Back so soon. What is left to suffice to deal with? Um, if you didn't fully pull, pay attention to what was being on screen uh, during the silentness, he got pretty cocky with me. So let's see uh, if we can uh, cure him of that cockiness. Yep. Once again, we will try to find and defeat the Queen of Scales. The matriarchs of the lizard people have laid entire cities to waste. All right. No recommended. Ooh. Looks like some stuff got updated and I wasn't paying attention. So, <laughs> let's look around. Um, do I have anything new? If not, I will just add something. Uh, that's fine. Alright. What are these? Uh, new stuff. Welcome to the wildcard update for Hand of Fate. Update adds different fates that you can select in order to change the way the game plays. Each fate provides different modifiers to play. Uh, it's mode default hard. Oh, cool, cool, cool. We might be going through occasionally and doing some of these. Uh, but since I've been playing in default all this time, we're just going to leave it default. No change there. And let's see here. We need to add two more. So cave shelter, since it's brand new. Let's see if we got anything else. Um, nothing else. So how about? Hmm. Uh, we'll just keep the apprentice. And we'll call it with that. And let's start the game. I've seen these moves repeated so many times by so many people. All right. Of course, this is your game. You bring something of yourself to the table, so even the same moves have a difference about them. You are even different to the way you began. And so it goes. Yep. So we start with the Blessing Lizard Eater. As you can see, it's received one food for every lizard kill, which will help us contain food, especially since we're after the Queen of Scales. So let's start it off. Angry Guildmaster. You know, it's a little quiet for me. Let me uh, turn my volume up here. There we go. I can hear a bit better. As you travel the dark streets, you travel the dark streets of Stigel one night, and no man stops a mighty steed, nearly knocking you down. Uh, Fifty-fifty. I'll take my odds. Choice. The answer is B. Aww. Draw three pain cards. While reaching for low hanging coin purse, your hand becomes entangled in the reins. You are dragged along underneath the horse for some time. Five max health. This is a lovely start. Five food. Five gold. Oh, that ain't so bad. That could have been a lot worse. We're moving on ahead. Demon Trader 2. I don't think I have anything he wants. Yeah, he wants two of them. Forward, Twisted Canyon, Lost in Swamp. Nope, we're just going to go on to the forest escape. Alrighty, uh, traveling healer that way. Okay. I was left these simple pieces, and from them I have built a palace of memories, a convoluted maze. But few will ever reach the end of. Will you be one of them? 
All right, summer solstice. Let's see here. Let us take a token on their foolishness. You make your way to the sacred stones at midday on the summer solstice. The druids, still clad from head to toe in their long robes, are all standing quietly on the stones waiting for you. One of them speaks. We are ready to begin. You pace the parameter of the stones while the druids form a circle and begin chanting. Soon their lone droning attacks the attention some of some ratmen. Draw two monster cards. Six and the queen. Oh, this is going to be so fun. There we go. What? Oh, I might need to kind of check out my computer after this episode. Yeah, this this might end unfortunately rather quickly. Oh yeah, I'm I'm not going to pass this. Yep, that's what I thought. <laughs> totally not ready for that. <laughs> that's a lovely way to start this episode. Uh, Queen of Scales, one more time. Uh -huh. A lot of merchants. I have made my wager. Retribution. Struck by a range attack, there's a chance the attacker will be stunned for three seconds. It's not bad. <clears throat> Summer Solstice, yet again. Uh, yep. <laughs> Take two on the same fight. <laughs> Here's hoping for the best. Yeah! 
Uh. All right, so that is done with. <laughs> okay. With the Ratman dispatched, you turn back to check on the progress of the Druid's ceremony. They are they appear oblivious to you, absorbed in their chanting, and the ritual continues. You skirmish with the Ratman seems to have brought the attention of a group of bandits. Draw two monster cards. Alright, seven bandits. Um gonna have to play it safe, but at least it's just bandits. Really would like this to have come when I had like abilities or something, but <laughs> that's okay. Oh, lovely on. I know this game ain't gonna give it to me. Nice treasure picker. Every card tainted by your No 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 single minded purpose. The same singularity of purpose that brings you here. I'd like to just quickly get out of the swamp. Well, it's all skeletons and two bandits. Okay. I can handle this pretty well. But a swamp card right in the beginning is not a good thing. There we go. That wasn't so bad. <laughs> Took some damage, more than I'd like to. But, <sighs> that's the name of the game. Three game cards. Ten gold. I'm sure you're great. Thirty gold. Uh, select one to keep. 
control three. Huge hammer, heavy armor, medium armor. Uh, uh, yeah, I'm going with the uh, huge hammer. Sometimes form follows function and vice versa. In this case, it's called a huge hammer. You take a guess. <laughs> Tavern wager. Um, I'd rather not. Uh, you know, uh, 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 since it's just gold. Eh, failure. I'm sorry, I'm just out the 20 gold. Cave rescue. Seems our pirates and our bandits have cut from the same cloth. Do you think it's true that men are alike wherever you find them? Or is it just that our memories fade and continue with the cold passage of time? Ah, uh, my favorite. Hammers. They will always get the job done for me. <laughs> Maybe I'll stand a better chance. Draw three game cards. Fifteen health. Well, that fully heals me. And ten food. Yeah, I like this. So let's see here. Oh, that must be the end. That's fine by me. We will hitch a ride. Better than trudging along a muddy road. Certainly. Call for a priest. I'm not the first to deal the cards. Old graveyard. I do not expect that we will be the last. In an old abandoned graveyard, the restless spirits sense the presence of a blessed soul and remain quiet. You spend a peaceful night, awakening well rested and fully recovered from your wounds. The card's token is now yours. Okay, that's nice. Um, I don't plan to call for the priest, so we're going to pass it on by. And, yep, that's going to be the exit. Marketplace in Summers. Nope, where it was going to continue on. I'm after the queen. Head downwards, if you dare. I'm after the queen. Traveling mage. You can hope that, as each card is unveiled, as each Let's new see. concept is explored, that we learn something about ourselves, or something about you. Let's see, what's he got for sale? Horna. Dragon ring, nice. Hag wraps in. Shrink slow, weakening your opponent. I'd like to have those. Um, yeah, I, I plan to sell you. Uh, I need another eight gold. Can I even get eight gold? anything. Uh, if I sell the merchant ring, which I don't really have to have, I can get those hag wraps. They'll help in combat. I think I will. I'd, I'd rather have, um, yeah. It's not enough that you kill them. You'll curse them too. Uh, let's see, six dollars. Uh, I'm, uh, I'll hold on. Squeaky chair. <laughs> Alright, and uh, down we go. Oh, we, look at that. We found the exit, and I'm more than willing to go ahead and take it. I say that I created this day. Many of the things I've oh. are true, but not that. I do not know who created it. I. Mean. 
Ooh, nice. You are pleasantly surprised to find that you were very close to the outskirts without realizing it. Traveling jeweler. We're gonna pass it on by. No money. Noble trader. Decline. Because, uh... I don't have anything I want to sell. Um, no, I'm quite happy to just move on. Yep, exit portal. Now, this is my Games Not in the way you think. Golem hunting party. They evolve around the players who flow through. The things they love and hate become part of our firmament. So who is the true creator. So two of the lava golems. Golems. No, golems. <laughs> Golem made of lava. That'd be funny. Alrighty. I've got my hammer. That makes me happy. Oh, traps. One down. Oh, I can go all the way back. Shoot, I didn't know that. And there goes the second. Okay. Not so bad. Food for thanks. Golem hunting party. Alright. Success! Charge into battle. I don't mind fighting another golem. It's not so bad. I can't remember, do I have to fight three of the cards or three of the golems? Because if it's three of the golems, this will finish it. Down he goes with a shield hit. Not bad. Okay. Guess we'll find out in a second. Food for thanks. I didn't get the token, so. Uh oh. I guess I have to go pick up the food. <laughs> Blood auction. Uh I don't plan to. Traveling Tinker. Gonna pass it on by. I don't have no money. Twisted Canyon. We're gonna just leave it. Pass it on by. We're doing okay right now. Gonna head down. For the Devil's Carnival. This token will unlock Maybe we'll get lucky this time. And see here. We're going for huge success. <gasps> yes! Cheers and gasps draw you to a large tent. Inside you discover a number of spectacles being performed by costume artists. Can we do it again? Choose from these options. 
No, it's all right. Unseen hands relieve you of some of your gold as you watch f a fine white horse being commanded to perform a variety of tricks for the gopping crowd. Draw one gold pain card. Nah, I'm not worried. Five. <laughs> Draws me down to four. Sometimes you find yourself standing at the edge of a forest, the sounds of the crowd behind you. Day is just dawning. But which day? Looking back, you see ruined buildings of a country town long abandoned. Alright. Not this time. Devil's choice. In truth, though, all choices are the devil's choice. Even the <sighs> choice to do nothing. Yep, he's going to put me against the other two, so I'm quite okay with that. I don't have to deal with the jack. I'm fine with that. Six uh, lizards I can handle. I've got my hammer. I'm full health. Let's do this. Uh, doesn't look like no fireball fireballers. They all seem to be um, warriors class. So. Just a long, tedious fight of me bashing them to death. <laughs> Alright, let's, uh... There we are. One left. And down he goes. And we did that unscathed. Not bad. That was a good fight. I quite enjoyed that. <laughs> After getting our butts whooped so much. <laughs> so you draw one equipment. We've got the angel wings. Greater movement speed. Ooh. Ten max health. Oh cool. So and some extra food. The apprentice. We will have their own rules. Decline. Power, sea voyage! Board the ship. She's out there now. Waiting for you. Alrighty. So let's go. Ambush. Every game must include an element of surprise. Two monsters. Three mages. Four rats. Ah, oh, that's no fun. Uh, let's get rid of the mages. They will hinder me.
All right, those guys are gone. Ow. All right, these guys back here are really annoying. All right, and oh, there they go. They took half my health, but I don't have to worry about them anymore. I hopefully will heal up nicely before I uh, uh, find the queen. Sounds like I'm just about there too. So, all right, none of them survive. Three game cards, extra equipment. Yes, a new shield. And we're going to equip that. Is that what you're going to do? Some extra food and some gold. Not too worried about the gold. Call for the priest. Um, yeah, you know, let's approach the shop. Uh, ooh, we can buy a blessing. Mm, no, no, we can't. <laughs> but we can do the next best thing and heal. No need to buy food. We've got plenty this run. Alright, on to the next. The Holy Forge. We don't have the metal to give him, so we will leave. Uh, traveling Healer. We are fine. Because we're out of money. And there's the Queen. Queen of Power. The majestic Queen of Scales spits powerful fireballs, and her totem prevents the death of any of her children. It is said that if you destroy a queen's totem, its spell will be broken and any surrounding lizards will be damaged. It is not known whether anyone has successfully achieved this. So I gotta destroy her totem before I do anything else. Lovely. There's a token in it for you if you win. Alright, All right, Queen. Let's do this and she comes with four others that's not so bad ooh she has big ears I guess that's her totem next to her oh I think that's the queen going down. So now it's just the scales left. Oh god, I am moving really quick with this headband. Uh, I know I'm hurting them. Because I've watched them fall, but... They're not letting me... Alright, take this. That's what I needed right there. Alright, now I've got their attention. Alright, victory is ours! <laughs> After many a try, victory is ours. 
You have destroyed something priceless, my friend. Do you ever wonder if your fellow hand and the damage it causes are worthwhile? Alrighty. For bringing blessed peace to the old graveyard, we receive. Yeah, 25 health. Oh, cool. So we've got health potions we can get. That's nice. And spiritual healing. That's cool. As a reward for defeating the Lizard Queen, we get an immovable object. Shield Breaker. Enormous Shield. King of Plague. And Minotaur Maze. That sounds fun. We come close to an end for all things. Alright everybody, that was another episode of Hand of Fate with your favorite cow, Anomaly Stratic. Um, I'll be trying to put in soon. I know we're nearing the end. We've got a couple more things to do. I'm not sure how many episodes it'll take. I will probably go through endless mode for an episode or two and I'll definitely check out the other um, stuff that came in that update in the future. Um, but I kind of want to just get through story mode with uh, default settings and all that since that's what we've been playing through. Uh, so until next time, everyone have a good day and uh, take it easy.